Hello and welcome to this tutorial about processing audio signals in Kronos. Audio streams flow through Kronos patches exactly like any other data stream. Unlike sliders and other user interface widgets, audio sources update regularly at the sample rate of your sound card. To audition an audio stream, use the Audio Out sync. To test our sound, let's hook up a sine oscillator to our sound card. Check your sound card setup by opening the server menu and clicking on Audio Setup. To compile your program and hear its output, open the workspace menu and click on Build. Clicking on Stop will end the audio stream. You can mix audio and control signals to make interactive programs. Audio signals have higher priority, so in general, when a module receives both audio and control signals, its output will be audio. Let's replace our fixed oscillator frequency with a user-controllable one. In addition, let's add a volume control. We use a dial-style control in this example. Insert such a control by selecting Dial Adjust the dial range by opening up its properties You can also select from three graphics Bar, Arc and Dial All of them work similarly You can click and drag to adjust or double-click to type a value. Let's use a range of 200 to 600 for our frequency dial. The default range of 0 to 1 is OK for our volume control. Embed the frequency dial in the oscillator input. Then let's add a multiplication node for volume control. Hooking up the multiply node with the oscillator and the volume dial completes this patch. 